I got the head loose on it, you know, I ain't got it real tight. Yeah. How's that metal sound? How are you? Good, how are you? Hey, I'm Tom. I'm Tom. Tom. Well, okay. Oh, yeah. I'm Tom. I'm Tom. Okay, nice to meet you, Tony. Just kind of hang around. Right
you to Virginia. Music? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I was uh, kind of left New Hampshire and just kind of trying to jam my way down to Florida, turn around and go back, see what I can learn in a couple of weeks. Oh, yeah? <laughs> see if I can... You're in the, you're in the spot. You, the rest of it's going to be a waste of time. <laughs> okay, then. Both ways. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I figured I'd hang around here for a couple of days. 
Let's see what I can learn. Hey, where's the uh, from? There, uh, there's a jam tomorrow night at Independence. Yep, that's what I heard. So there's one on Thursday at Freeze. And Friday, White Top Mountain is going to be here at the theater. That's one of the best old kind bands there is. Oh, really? <coughs> and Saturday, they're going to be up at Freeze. So, you don't need to go nowhere else. This is the mecca. That could be. Yeah, you just be wasting your gas. <laughs> there's a there's a little bit of kind of around in Jacksonville and uh, yeah. Somebody told me like if you head down the west coast of Florida, Dade City. Dade City is actually not guy from the west coast. It's kind of yeah, on the west coast. It's, it's probably 30 miles. Away. There's a little pocket there. A little pocket. There's a little pocket in Jacksonville. Okay. A pocket in Tallahassee. There's a pocket in the Orlando area. Yeah, I'm on that, actually I'm on that email that they sent me that. Well, they just had their uh, Old Time Fiddle convention last weekend. Yes. Yeah, this weekend? Last weekend, yeah. Where are you from? Uh, New Colorado. Hampshire. New Hampshire. New Hampshire. <coughs> I've seen a road track out here in Colorado. It looked like Colorado Tag. Yeah, it's, it's New Hampshire. It's mine. Oh, that's yours? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Road track. Yeah. I'm surprised you knew that. You must have known what they looked like because I took all the. I, I got rid of everything. It's indicated. Yeah, I know about it. Come on, we're in the me. Actually, that one was not. That's 20 years old. My mom and stepdad, they bought one of this. Early 90s, I was with Tim the first time. I think it's Phil and Smith. That road track camper. One mom's got that road track camper. Yeah, mine's a dodge also. Hey, how's it going?
about South Orlando. Okay. Right in the middle of the state. Nothing there but old people in Orange Groves. Wow, yeah. Orange Groves. Yeah, they're all around us. I've got three orange trees, banana trees, coconut palm, and some other palms. When, when do you harvest um, that? The oranges. And all of them. When any of them? Banana trees have been out while we're down there. It takes about four years. My neighbors got some and they bought some. Uh, the coconut palm is not big enough. That's the coconut on it. Solid trees Actually, when you buy them, you buy them to produce at a certain time of the year. Visit. And I 
I said, I'm going to jam you. want to go? She wanted to find out. So now the music's not working. She's fine. I said, Go out for some badness. So after about three songs, she leaned up over my shoulder. She said, you didn't tell me it was this bad. I tried to. That's one, mate. Oh, really? Well, you're, you're well into autumn. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. Your best way to spend your shower. Has it good? Uh, yeah. It's good. We are the colors of it. Yeah, the address is just one of them. Oh, just one of them. Okay. 865 Miss me, I'm right on the face. I look out my favorite window and I can see Lake Jackson. I tell her it's 11 miles around Lake Jackson. Yeah. He does like a 20 mile ride with the train. We do that and then we come back and go down to the park. There's a pile of hammock parks. It's just three or four miles down the road. One street over from one street down from me. Once you get down there, there's a road that goes there all the way to 66, which will give you 20 miles if you do it right now. But I ain't tough enough for that. Probably can't even do that. I can't remember where it is. I can't remember where it is.
it can go downhill, you know, the wind is. Never seems to be going with the wind. It always changes. Around that light, you're going to get and pull the light there, and you're going to get wind down here. I'm sure I like this. You know, one side or the other, you're going to get wind. We just got a side lane all the way around, so if you need to ride a road, you ride a side lane. We usually ride a side lane. We don't run past that. People are going to The city's taking his race about this time, so that'll really make it better. Yeah. 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 If you want to try to go before you go back down, we'll go on the road up and then we'll get you up on the Blue River Trail. Get ready for the train. I'm leaving Monday. Yeah, there is an exit. Yeah, how do you look at I'm trying to get things situated. What am I taking with me? Because I brought a bunch of tools to work on my place. And I'm taking all these bags and I'm going to put them next to me. Just to come to decide what to load and, you know. One section's kind of neat because there's actually a tunnel that you go through. Oh, yeah. Where's that at? That's uh, south of Breeze Junction, north of the Hill and Bend Road. She started being Betty. You go through the tunnel and then you actually go to Freeze no, Junction where right the trail goes to Freeze and the, the loop part comes, comes off, the uh, spur comes off on the daylight. Where they intersect, the, the spur goes actually over the, the river, so you go over the truss over the river. Where it's going to be. Just okay. when you were dancing, it's a nice, uh, oh, yeah. nice trail. Yeah. That's further east, north east. Get out there and see what it's like there.